Incumbent Sheriff Victor Mason says he's running for re-election and he could have a lot of competition on the campaign trail. Two law enforcement professionals have their sights set on becoming the Hines County Sheriff. I'm Calendula Green. I'm the spokesperson for the Jackson Police Department. I've been with the Jackson Police Department for almost 14 years. My name is Richard Spooner. I'm a Jackson resident and former law enforcement officer for with over 21 years with the Hines County Sheriff's Office, and I'm currently running for sheriff. In addition to Richard Spooner and Calendula Green, retired JPD Chief Lee Vance, along with former Edwards Chief and current JPD Officer Torrance Mayfield, both say they are considering a run to be top cop. Incumbent Sheriff Victor Mason has served for the past three years. Sheriff Mason says he plans to run for re-election. So why do you think so many people are running for sheriff? I really don't have an idea as to why so many people are running. Hines County Supervisor Robert Graham says the job comes with a lot of big responsibilities. Wherever the sheriff is, uh, we'll have a $20 million budget uh, from the Board of Supervisors. That's over 30 percent of our annual budget. So uh, they have, will have over 420 employees. That's over just about half of the county employees. So it's a very big job. Supervisor Graham says the sheriff also has to stay in compliance with a federal consent decree to fix the Raymond Detention Center, bringing it up to standard for inmates housed there. Well, to make sure you have uh, properly trained individuals, to make sure that you provide the resources, to make sure you have uh, proper intake, uh, to make sure that you provide even proper food. So a lot of things to focus on. Now, we're hearing as many as a dozen people are considering a run for sheriff. They can't even qualify to run until after the new year. Live in the newsroom, Ross Adams, 16 WAPT News.